Former WWE Superstar Hornswoggle here, and you are watching The Man Games. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button, follow this channel, like this video, and let us know in the con comments, in the comments below. See, this is why WWE didn't let me talk. I'm not very good at it. But let us know in the comments below if you're loving all of this great content and what you want to see next. Take care. Hello and welcome to The Man Games. In this video today, we are looking at how to create Nick Gage. So he is like a hardcore death style um, wrestler. He was on AEW last week. He's going to be fighting Chris Jericho on this week's AEW Dynamite. So that's my thought. We look at how to create Nick Gage in this video today. So the attire on the left is kind of similar to his attire that he had on AEW. The attire on the right is like an older kind of attire that he's had on in the past. So yeah, before we go into the how to create part of the video though, if you are a new watcher to The Man Games and you do enjoy this video, please think about subscribing to the channel, it's a great way to help support The Man Games. Also, please remember to click that like button if you do enjoy the video and let us know who you think is going to win on Wednesday Night Dynamite. Is it going to be Jericho or Nick Cage? Let us know in the comments. Right, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go back, we're going to go to face. So we don't have a photo capture, so we're just going to go to templates. That is the template we just used there, that one there. And then if we go to body, so the weight is 206 and the height is 511 and the body is type 1 and type 6. So that's all you need to know for that. And right, so now we're going to go into the um, ring in-ring attire. So appearance, hair. So that is the hair there, that one there. So we just click on that. So that is the hair, that one there. So click on colour, so that is the correct shade that you're looking for, that one there for the colour. And now if we go back, we go down to facial hair, so that is the beard, that one there, and the colour is that shade there. Right, so now we're going to go to clothing, so upper body, so t-shirts first. So we've just got this t-shirt here, that one there, material is cloth, and obviously the colour is black. And now image, so we've got this image off the community creation, just type in Nick Gage and you'll find it. But the outline of his um, logo now is white, so we've got these images here to go around it to make it white. So I'll just click on that one to show you, you'll see it flashing. So we've just done that over all three parts as you can see that one there and now this one on the third one and finally that one is your fourth one so then it should look like that right then so now if we go down to lowers so bottoms so these are the ones we chose then one's there, material is just all default, and then colours, so we've got that shade of green, same again, then we've got black and black. And then finally we're going to go down to socks, so we've got them socks there, materials are default and default, and obviously the colours are black and black. And then if we go down to shoes and boots, so these are the shoes that we've chosen and the material same again they're all default and the colors are all black right then so now we go into the in ring sorry no we've just done the in ring if we go to the entrance attire all that's different is the um the headwear so if we go to the head go down to headwear so it's just that one there material is just default default and the colors are exactly the same as it is when you click on it so that was the first attire now if we look into the second attire so if we go to appearance the beard is um, a slightly different shade so it is a bit more browner as 
um, it's more of like a, a younger Nick Gage on the right, so the, the beard's a bit, you know, not as grey. So then if we go to clothing, upper body. So now if we go to tops, so we're going to go to material, material is just default, then that colour is just white. And then if we go to top, then the images for the top, so we've got them two images there, therefore um, round the neck of the top, and then we've got the balls and Jordan, so balls on the front, Jordan on the back, image there off the community creation, you can type in Michael Jordan or, uh, or Chicago Bulls and you'll find it there, on the community creation that is obviously. And then if we go to hands, so we've got the this hand there, like that, so material is default and default, and obviously the colours are white, so that's same on both hands hands. Now if we go to bottoms, so we've got these um, jorts or shorts, whatever you want to call them. Materials are all default I do believe. And your colour is that shade of blue, black, that shade there, and that shade there. But the blue is the main part anyway. And then if we go down to socks, so the socks are the same one as before. And then if we go to shoes and boots. So these are the shoes and boots for this one here. Materials are all default I do believe, yes they are. And then colours, we've got black, black, black. So it looks like that. Right. So then if we go to the entrance attire, so it's it's um, similar as before, apart from the colour. So if we go to head, down to headwear, it's that one that we chose before, but the colour is obviously red there, not black. And that is it, that is how to create this, these two attires of Nick Gage. Well I do hope you enjoyed this video today. If you are excited about the Nick Gage and Chris Jericho match, please let me know in the comments. I'm not really sure how they're going to go about this because really you think Jericho is going to win but can he win? So yeah, it's going to be really interesting to see what to do on AEW this week. So yeah, if let me know your thoughts or your predictions in the comments. Love to know you guys' feedback. Also, if you are new watch to the Man Games and you do enjoy this video, please think about subscribing to the channel. Also, please remember to click that like button and make sure to check out the other content on the channel. If you have subscribed, please make sure to have your notifications turned on so you know when our next video goes up on the channel. So thank you very much for watching the Man Games today and I'll see you on the next video.